Hey folks, this is Jeff again with SimSamurai.net. Uh, this is just a continuation of my series of showing you how to hook up the GoFlight hardware avionics uh, to their software package, which allows you to assign functions to the hardware units. Um, basically, in the first two series, I showed you how to hook up their GF uh, P8 unit and the first of my series of the GF166 Alpha unit uh, for my comm radios. I have two of these and so uh, you know, depending on if you use one or two your, your software assignments may be a little different but basically um, in the first unit I am using this whole radio for my COM1, COM2 and transponder select and my second unit I use as a NAV1, NAV2 and ADF select and so now in this uh, third series I'm going to hook up the unit called the GoFlight T8 or Tango 8 unit. Um, and basically, I use it for things like auto feather, prop sync, Peter heat, etc. It's the little toggle uh, unit that has eight toggles on it. And I have it uh, signed from uh, left to right. I use it as auto feather, prop sync, pedo heat, uh, de ice, um, fuel pump, avionics master alternator master and then battery master that's how I have mine set up and again if you have flight sim X or flight sim 2004 you're going to have to do this twice once for each flight sim because it saves a separate config file uh, for each flight sim so let's go ahead and start with flight sim X so basically it's pretty easy um, you can just select uh, number one number two you know just whichever drop down obviously so let's start with one number one and uh, let's just look for auto feather. There's auto feather right there. And so there's number one. Uh, number two, we want it for prop sync because I like to fly some multi engine turboprop aircraft. So let's just scroll down to P for prop. There's prop sync. Number two, three, let's go to pedo heat. Again, starts with the P. So let's go to P for pedo heat. There's number three. Now let's go to number four for de-ice and I'm going to assume that's going to be under D or de-ice there it is and number five for fuel pump I'm going to assume it starts with F for fuel there's fuel pump and let's move on to number six which I have assigned to avionics master there's AP Master, which is for Autopilot Master, so don't get that confused. Let's go down to Avionics. There's Avionics Master right there. And then number seven for, what do I have that set for? Alternator. Uh, you know, that's important too. Can't forget your alternator to charge your battery. And let's see, this might be a little difficult to find. Low key hunt. Alternator, alternator, we'll be up there. Sometimes things are assigned differently than you would think they are, and so you just have to scroll through the list to find it. Somebody play the Jeopardy music, please. There we go. Alternator Master. It's almost at the very beginning. I skipped right over it. So there's Alternator Master for number seven. And Battery Master, I'm going to hope that starts with a B. And there it is, Battery Master. So there we go. Auto Feather, Prop Sync, Pedo Heat, De-Ice, Fuel Pump, Avionics Master, Alternator Master, and Battery Master. And so, same thing, I just assigned this for Flight Sim X. We're going to have to do it again for Flight Sim 2004, and I won't bore you with the details of doing that twice. So, anyway, I just want to show you uh, the final steps for the GF T8, and next we'll move on to the uh, RP48. For the GoFlight uh, configurator here. Thanks for watching and tune into the next video. Bye.